UC Davis Athletics presents the Heitman Award to the top female athlete each June. Given the success of the women's basketball program through the years, it's surprising that it took nearly three decades after Pam Martin received the honor in 1979 for the team to produce another winner of the prestigious award. Then again, perhaps a player like Jessica Campbell comes along just once a generation. When she received the award in 2008, it came at the end of an impressive career, for which it was hard to pinpoint one particular strength since she was so adept in all areas of the game. Former UC Davis women's basketball coach, Sandy Simpson. Uh, she, she was a scorer, she could defend, uh, she could rebound uh, out of her position. She was a classic wing player. She probably possessed um, an ability that's a dying art in this game, which is the mid-range jumper. Maybe the best mid-range shooter that I had an opportunity to coach in my career. Carol Reich maybe being the other, other one that would match her. And she had that ability to create her own shot too, which, uh, which not everybody on our team was able to do. So when come crunch time, we could put the ball in Jessica's hands and she had the ability to create her own shot or the presence in the court sense to be able to find the open person were she to be defended. So uh, she was just a great all around player. It was that versatility that entrenched Campbell's name across several all time Aggie career charts. She ranks third in scoring with more than 1,400 points. She's tied for ninth in rebounds and ranks in the top 10 for both assists and block shots. She was also money from the free throw line, making nearly 90% of her attempts over the last two years. Campbell committed to UC Davis when it was still Division II and played throughout the reclassification period. She held a 3.8 gray point average and received numerous honors in international relations. She planned to graduate after the 06-07 season until Coach Simpson convinced her to redshirt her fourth year and return for 07-08, the Aggies' first season in Division I and the Big West Conference. It was a tough decision for Campbell, who had to extend her academic plan to a fifth year but one that paid off mightily for UC Davis. Campbell and fellow senior Ellen Porshneva, who missed the same season due to a knee injury, combined to help the Aggies become just the second team in league history to make the Big West Championship game in its first year of eligibility. Again, Sandy Simpson. Uh, but both of them being eligible for us, um, allowed us to make that run that first year and, and finish second during the regular season in the Big West Conference and advance to the conference tournament championship game that year and then get an NIT berth at the end, which was our first chance of postseason. It's quite unusual for a first, uh, first year eligible team to have the level of success that that team had. And I think you can point all of that really to, to Jessica's unselfish decision. Campbell was named to the All-Big West Conference first team that season, following up the Division I All-Independent Honorable Mention she earned as a junior. According to Simpson, Campbell's greatest part of her game was not necessarily how well she played basketball, but the manner in which she played it. She had a very dry uh, sense of humor, very dry wit. Uh, she was somebody that kept things in perspective, uh, she was very humble as a player, and I think that's one of the things that endeared her to her teammates. You always want your best player to be your hardest worker. Well, she not only was our hardest worker uh, and engendered the respect of her teammates through that, but she was also one of our most humble players. She was never somebody who thought it was all about her. And when you have a player that's both a hard worker and humble, you can't help but lead, and players can't help but follow. And, uh, and that's probably the thing I remember most about her off the court and uh, because of that, she was one of the best leaders we've ever had. A versatile player, an honors student, an outstanding leader. In other words, Jessica Campbell was the complete UC Davis women's basketball player. Tonight, we honor this once in a generation student athlete with her induction into the Cal Aggie Athletics Hall of Fame. <laughs>